Hello everyone. This is noodle, rice, and everything spice. And today I'm making you a pot sticker. So I have about half a pound of shrimp, half a pound of ground chicken. So the shrimp I just chopped it with the knife, so it's a small, small piece. So now I need some uh, onion. So I'm gonna put some onion in here. This is all the seasoning I have here. So I put about, I put in here, that way it's easy for you guys to figure it out how much onion you need to put in here, the green onion. So, okay. I need about a cup of green onion chopped, put it in here. And then I need uh, cilantro, but I use the bottom of it. I don't use the leaf, much of the leaf. So I, I thinly, finely slide it in here. Okay. I guess about one for a cup in there. And now I need the carrot. I need to put them in the mixer, chop it up. I don't know yet how much you need, but I will put it in a cup and show you how much. This much thin, chop it and see how many cups that I need in here. One. I like a lot of vegetable in there. It tastes good. It's about three cup of cabbage. Okay. And I have about a teaspoon of black pepper. And I have about one tablespoon of uh, sesame oil. I have one tablespoon of uh, oyster sauce and I have about two teaspoon about um, half teaspoon of salt and it's about two tablespoon of soy sauce and two tablespoon of cornstarch about one table and one teaspoon of ginger and one eggs. I add another teaspoon of salt. So we're gonna make them all up. Okay. 
I'm gonna let them sit at least 10, 10 or 15 minutes. Okay. You go ahead. You go ahead. So after we mix all this up, and I, I have to put one more teaspoon of the corn cornstarch. Okay. So that be two two tablespoon and one teaspoon, and then I put an, about a another teaspoon of salt if you don't like to you don't have to okay if you don't like to too much salt you don't have to so now we're gonna wrap them you take this take the dough put the water around it and then you put the the meat seasoning in here and you grab the, the middle one first and then you put this side on this side up a little bit and then you squeeze them and another side a little bit and then you squeeze them you see how pretty that is so now you squeeze this one up again and then you use another finger to help you so and then do another one and then squeeze them okay you see how it did so I'm gonna do another one this one I put a lot of uh, stuffing in there so I'm gonna put a little bit less okay uh, now, okay, now is another one to wrap. Okay, I'm gonna put the seasoning in here. So, and grab the middle one and push this side up a little bit and squeeze it, and push another one up and squeeze it, and put another one side up, squeeze them, and another side up and squeeze them and push it tightly make sure they seal and that's how they look Isn't that pretty okay and then I will show you how to make a sauce for dipping it's dipping sauce so I'm making a sauce for the pot sticker so I use about two tablespoons of sesame oil And I use about half tablespoon of uh, garlic. I like ginger, so I put a lot of ginger. So I use about tablespoon of ginger for the sauce. So this is hoisting sauce. I use about a tablespoon and I use soy sauce. About half tablespoon and oyster sauce. I use about One tablespoon. That's about one teaspoon of sugar. I'm going to add a little bit of water. I'm going to put like a half tablespoon of uh, sweet uh, black soy sauce. And I need about 
two tablespoon of red chili cilantro, the one half seed. And that's it. The sauce is done. I'm just going to cook them down a little bit. is done. And now I'm going to make the dumpling. Yes, I put the oil in the pan and I add about half cup of water and then we just going to cook them until the water dry. Okay. okay. See, it's cooked. It's like you steam them. And this is how they look like. The bottom going to be crunchy. And you can try them dip with other sauce. And we're going to try them. I know it's hot. So. Wow. It's so good. You see that? So delicious. Thank you.